Welcome to Operation Research. At the end of this video, you should be able to understand or determine the economic life of equipment whose maintenance cost increases and resale price decreases with the time. For the timeline of this video, check the description section and also join the telegram channel for more updates regarding the operation research. We will see this with the help of one example. Now the problem statement is given over here. A manufacturer finds from his past records that the cost per year associated with machine with a purchase price of 50,000 are as follow and we have been given the value of maintenance cost over the 8 years. Now here you can see that the maintenance cost is increasing every year starting from the first year whereas the scrap value or resale value of the machine is decreasing every year. Now here we have to determine the optimum replacement policy that is at what year this machine should be replaced so that the average cost will be minimum. Now in order to calculate the optimum time duration the first thing that we have to determine is the difference between price and the resale price which is given by the C minus S. So C is your purchase price which is given as 50,000 rupees and S is your scrap value or resale value. Now as the scrap value is different for every year we will have a different C minus S value. So for first year it would be the difference between this 50,000 minus 35,000 so it will reduce to 15,000. Likewise for second year it will be 50,000 minus 25,000 and the value will be 25,000. Similarly for third year 50,000 minus 17,000 yeah, the value is 33,000. Similarly we can compute this value for the remaining year. Now what is this indicate? The value of C minus S indicate that this is the cost if you use the machine for 4 year the total investment in your machine will be 38,000 and likewise. So let us see further. In order to calculate the optimum period for a replacement we have to prepare this kind of a table. Now this table will have columns like this is the replacement year, this is the maintenance cost we are going to take the maintenance cost which is given in the problem statement. This will be a cumulative maintenance cost. The difference between price and resale price that is C minus S which we have computed for the 8 year. So I have taken it directly from the last slide. This is the total cost. This total cost is summation of these two columns and this is the average cost which is nothing but whatever cost total cost we are getting we are going to get uh, we are going to divide it by the number of years so let us compute it for first year now in at the end of first year your maintenance cost will be 15000 which is given in the table or which is given in the problem statement now in first year your cumulative maintenance cost will be 15000 only the summation of these two costs will be 30,000 and as it has only one year so 30,000 divided by 1 will give me a value of 30,000 only. Now let us see what happens in the year 2 at the end of second year you will have or in second year you will have 16,000 as a maintenance cost. So for two years the maintenance cost will be addition of these two things. So 15,000 plus 16,000 that will give you the value of 31,000. When you add this difference between price and resale price you will get a figure of 56,000. So this is the summation of these two values. Now you have to divide it by 2 because your replacement year is second right so and we are interested here in average cost per year. So this will be value of 28 
thousand. Now here you can note that the average cost is decreasing for the second year. For first year it is thirty thousand. For second year it is twenty eight thousand. Let us see what happens in the third year. Now. In third year, your maintenance cost will be eighteen thousand, right? And your community maintenance cost will be the summation of all these three, so that will give me a value of forty nine thousand. Plus this C minus S will give me a value of eighty two thousand. Now you have to divide it by three because we are in third replacement year, right? So this value will give it will become 27,333.33. Now here you can note that it is still decreasing, right? Now let us see what happens for the next eight years. So we will directly compute it and you can compute it with the same procedure, right? Uh, also note that the PDF of uh, this particular solution uh, is available in the description section now i will directly calculate all these values right and here you can note that the minimum average cost value is 27000 rupees and which is for fourth year and fifth year now we can say that it is better or it is best to replace the machine at the end of fifth year because this cost is again increasing for the sixth year so if you're using it beyond the fifth year you will have to pay a more money but if you use this machine for only five years you have to bear the minimum average cost so this is the solution so you can download the same solution from the description section in pdf also uh, no, please watch the other videos related to the replacement model thank you